Hello, my name is Robin Gensler. I'm a software consultant with Walters Kluwer CCH. In this video, we're going to look at how to make changes in bulk using the Find and Change feature in the ProSystem FX Practice Management's Administration module. Now, there are many reasons why we may need to make changes to our practice management database. For this example, let's say that we have some employees who have moved from the Audit Department to the Tax Department. Now, it's true that we could go into each employee profile and change the department assignment on a one-by-one -one basis. That would work. However, it's not necessarily time efficient. Another option is to make that change to all of the employees at once. Let me show you how to do that. From the navigation pane, expand the Employee Find and Change, then the uh, General section, and then the Department section. Once here, determine how you would like to locate the list of employees to change. For example, click by department and then enter a department in the search field to see all of the employees assigned to the selected department. The same is true if you selected by office or by skill level. To see a list of employees, select by employee. Then press the control key on your keyboard to select multiple employees at a time. Once all of the appropriate employees have been selected, click the edit department button. The system will prompt you to see if you would like to make the changes one at a time or to all employees selected. Choose the second bullet to make the change to all of the employees selected. Then enter the correct department from the drop down list and click OK. Practice management will ensure that you want to make this change with one last prompt. Just click yes and the employees will now be assigned to the tax department. Another example for making changes in bulk might be to reassign clients from one partner to another. To do this, expand the Client Find and Change, and then the Staff section. And now consider how you would like to locate the list of clients to be reassigned. In this example, expand the Primary Partner section, and then click By Primary Partner. Then enter the partner's name in the search field. That generates a list of clients who are all assigned to the selected partner. Notice that we can see a total of the number of clients listed down here below. Now select the clients from the list. This time I'm going to use my shift key. Then click the edit primary partner button. Just like before, select the second bullet to change all at once and click OK. Then choose the appropriate partner and click OK and then click yes. Now you will see that the total number of clients assigned to John Preston is reduced as all of the other clients have been reassigned to Emma Brown. Thank you for taking the time to review this video. We hope that you found it interesting and informative.